What's up, everybody? John here. It is Saturday, the day of UFC 247, so we got it on here so we can get better watching and still getting better drilling. So, um, I got Ling with me, my partner. <laughs> These are the top five, my favorite top five cradles that you need to know if you're a, a wrestler. So, let's do this. Let's go down. Uh, yeah, face the camera for me. Yeah, right there. Perfect. So, we're going to start with the Hughes cradle. So, this is, I call this the Hughes cradle because John, he showed me this when I was in uh, high school, I believe. So the first thing we're gonna do, we know when we line up on top, we have to line up here, arm on the, the uh, elbow, hand on the waist, right? So hand that goes on the elbow to the chest, the hand that goes on the belly button near ankle. And I'm gonna put pressure into him, and I'm gonna drive. Yeah, that's what a wrestler's gonna do, right? So now, elbow in the neck, elbow behind the knee. So I'm here, boom. Now, I'm gonna take him straight back. Bottom knees the ribs, we got ourselves a fall. One more time, let's go different. Can you face the Perfect. So, off the whistle, inside leg, the leg closest to you. Here. Boom. Yeah, pressure, pressure, pressure. Right on. Bottom in the ribs, forehead in the temple. Okay, so that's number one. Number two. This one's the Herbert Cradle uh, after Jake Herbert, uh, world silver medalist, Olympian, NCAA champ, one of my good buddies. So, all we're gonna do, I'll throw this up, I'm gonna come to his head here. So I'm gonna come to his head, I'm gonna start pulling this way, right there. And this reaction is what I want, what he just gave me. I'm gonna hook this leg right here, so now I have a western hook, back here, I got his head. And now I'm gonna do, put this knee down for me, I don't wanna hurt you. I'm gonna push this hip away, right there, good. Don't move. It brought his head and his knee together, come back up, come back up, yeah. So I'm here, chin, I'm gonna pull and push. Boom. Now I lock it up. Oof, my back points. Good. One more time. So we're here. I attack. There's my hook. I pull and push. Boom. You okay? Okay, number three for you guys. So this one's going to be a little bit more, or we're going to hit this one on really good guys because this is a great setup. Um, I see a lot of college guys doing this. So all I'm going to do is I'm going to go palm up. And I'm going to try to drill his wrist down through the mat. Now I'm going to take a tight waist. And I'm going to drive at a 45 degree over his angle over his shoulder so that I can either try to catch his wrist and hit a, a tilt or a good guy will put his opposite hip away and bring this near leg up. So when I start coming here, I start driving. Yeah, that's what I expect good guys to do right here. So we just set up another cradle. Boom. Elbow in the knee. Over the neck. Yeah. And now I run him down. Right there. One more time. So this is for your, your really good wrestlers because this is what really good wrestlers are gonna do to respond when you start putting pressure here, right there. This inside leg's gonna come up because now they just relieved all the pressure. The problem is I set him up. Boom, there's my cradle. Right there. Head and feet, opposite side of the body. Cool. So Next one we're gonna do is going to be a Phil Davis cradle. So, um, what we're gonna need is I need a Western hook and just a power hack, something super simple. What you could do is combine things together. Let's go this cradle here, right? So now I scoop this leg. Just relax. Yeah, now come back. Yeah, right there. Good, so now, just bend this knee. Yeah, right there. So now I got my Western hook, I'm gonna go power half on this side. You can just relax here, yeah, right here. And I'm gonna start pulling his head down. I'm gonna pull his head down and close to me. And now I'm gonna take this knee, I'm gonna put it right over top of his head. Right there, don't move. So even if I have really short arms, I could still cradle this up. Finish my cradle. Good. This is the Phil Davis cradle because I've seen him hit it over and over and over again. And I know it works at a very high level. So, boom, we set him up right here. Right, so I exposed his ankle. Now I scoop right there. When you guys get really good, let's uh, face the, the TV for a second. When you start getting really good at this, you can just bend this thing and just relax. Here, what I want to do is I want to start using my feet like hands. So I'll scoop here. And now I got my western hook. And now I go power hat and I pull his head down, knee over top, right there. The last one is the simplest one. Go uh, to your belly real quick. Just lay down on your belly. Belly? Belly. Oh. belly. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we're here. Now, 
more than likely, if I get this guy flat, he's going to stay spread out. He's not going to want to give up cross face, right? So, right here, yeah, be strong. Yeah. So I'm going to post here and I'm going to cross face. Just relax. Right now, when I do this, I got to go pinky to elbow and I, I got to drop his, his shoulder to the mat right there. This is where I need him if I'm going to hit a cross face cradle. I need him on the other side. Now, when I start to run, so give me this back. When I start to run, I'm going to take this hand behind the ankle, not behind the thigh or the knee, behind the ankle. And be careful. Can you just spin to the camera again or to the TV again, please? Don't, don't do this too aggressively to start. Yeah, you'll hurt somebody. So if we turn him this way, now I got to run his body towards his, his other legs. So here, I go ankle, and now I start running. Just start with it. Right there, right there. So I'm gonna run him clockwise right into his own leg. Now, once I'm here, I'm not letting go of this arm. Not doing, I'm not doing this. I'm doing this, I'm gonna cover my watch. So if I was wearing a watch, it would be right here. I'm gonna come under, cover it. Bottom knee in the ribs, forehead in the temple. One more time. So I post, this will work even on big strong guys, post smash. Smash, shoulder. Yeah. Ankle. Run, 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 run. Over my watch. Those are the five cradles you need to know. Thank you.